They bleed as we do. Right, we set our challenge and said, okay, what, how can we increase the experience, how can we increase the story and characterization compared to movies? We really wanted the, the next-gen experience to be closer to the world of film. We really wanted to achieve that emotional depth for the characters. So for the first time, we're really allowed to take a lot of these film techniques for building characters and building rigs and apply them to games. Well, we were fortunate on Rise. We got to work with Imaginarium, and if, if you don't know anything about Imaginarium, that's Andy Serkis's uh, new mocap facility. Andy Serkis really revolutionized performance capture. I'll hold them off until the ship is cleared. No! You have to go. You must live. The Senate will listen to you. They're a commander. They have to. When casting Rise, we looked for theater actors, or actors with great amount of theater and television experience. And we wanted people that could stay immersed in the scene, the whole scene, because when you do performance capture, you really let the scene run for the entire span of the scene. We don't cut up for individual setups. So it was important to us to really get people that could strongly abstract and really live inside the world that we were creating. By doing that, we were able to really kind of keep players engaged, keep the story the focus. A lot of people look at, at the things we have and they see these emotional beats and without that pre-production, that work that we put in, you, you, we would never have grasped that. So with Rise we're able to capture all story characters with full performance capture. That means face, body and audio. And we had up to 12 characters at the same time on stage given the performance. That was an incredible experience. Performance capture allows us truly to allow an actor or a stuntman to fully perform the soul of a character, not just body language, but he can implement all his emotions, all his anger, and we can translate that in true virtual life instead of just animation. They have no honor. These vermin dare to stand against the might of Rome. They deserve to suffer our retribution. It's more like theater than film, in a way, because because there's this 360 capture of all the cameras and from every angle. You're mad! So you do get the, the feel of theatre and you, it's a raw um, emotion from every actor all the time. What you see while you're playing the game, the Marius that you see that you are playing with, I mean, he has over 700 joints, he has over 230 blend shapes in his face, he's got multiple layers of simulation for his cloth, for his leather straps. Uh, this is stuff that just wasn't possible on previous hardware generations. I mean, a, a traditional last-gen rig, you, you get, you know, high-end-wise, you get 60, 64 joints or, or bones in a face. And here, we just shatter that. I mean, we, we quadruple that number. Our target was to increase a, the emotional quality of gaming. Rise is going to be an amazing journey. We're going to merge story and action like you've never seen before. Achieved with CryEngine.